Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. This is going to be a message for the sign of Libra. So if you have Libra place, pl placements, placements, chances are this could resonate with you here, Libra. Let's get into it. Okay, let's see what we have. We have throne, position of authority. So you could have just got a new job recently. You could be stepping into some sort of new role. It could be that some of you, you could have been in a relationship with an individual where it was at one level. So it could be dating and it could be moving on to the next level. Somebody could be giving you some sort of flowers, some sort of appreciation. You could be being seen very highly. You could be being given some sort of recognition for something specific that you've worked on here. We've got the door. Opportunities are waiting for you here, Libra. We've got dog barking, advice from a friend. Somebody could want your advice at this time, Libra, because you are, Libras are very balanced. Lib um, Libras are all about sort of justice and bringing some equilibrium to situations here so it could be that somebody sees you as a voice of reason somebody regards you very very highly it could be that you are the go-between for somebody's success through whatever advice or you know whatever conversation you may have with an individual so just keep that in mind fair man dealings or relationship with a man with blonde gray or white hair this could be a man of this description you could be a man of that description take it as it resonates here this could be a different person or the same person here. Teapot, deep friendship with someone of the same sex here. So this definitely could be a friend that is coming towards you here, Libra. You could be bonding with somebody here. Oh, what a way to finish. We've got a rat, somebody working against you behind your back. Be very mindful of who you tell what to. Be very selective over the information that you tell people, what you're posting on social media who is watching, what you're saying, who's around you, who you can trust. There's a need to do this here. Be very selective. I don't believe this is the same individual that's coming to you for some sort of advice here. This is somebody else. So we'll see. Let's pull you an energy oracle. Oh, straight off the bat. We've got victory number 28 and door to spirit. Okay, you're definitely being guided here. Attachment number five here. Door to spirit, victory here. You're being divinely guided here. You're being shifted in a different direction here, but it's a pathway that's going to be very, very beneficial for you. With that door, we've got door to spirit and door here. And the victory here. So there's two references to door. Definitely some sort of new journey, new opportunity that is going to be opening up for you here. You could be 28 years of age. Number 32 could, could be significant here. Walking away. This could be that you need to detach from something first. Possibly heal here with broken heart. Walking away here. And attachment. This could be past attachment to someone else something else that you need to clear your energy of in order for this new take action is there also with those horses galloping to gain some sort of new opportunity or move into this new energy that your spirit guides your higher powers are wanting you to go for here yeah i'm use this step okay let's see what this is messages for libra please messages for libra yeah you're walking away you've had some kind of clarity here with the ace of swords you're walking away from things through that doorway i'm i'm getting you're definitely taking on some sort of new journey new experience or you're going to be here king of wands and you're doing it with a lot of confidence here a lot of charisma this could be a new business opportunity here you're having some sort of clarity here libra and you're moving yourself forward here people may see you and regard you as a very confident person that they can come to somebody who they can rely on i'm getting ace of swords seven of cups here you have a lot of options that are coming your way and you're gaining clarity over the direction the doorway the path that you want to choose here seven of pentacles i feel like you could have had confusion over what you wanted to invest in in the past with the seven of pentacles and that seven of cups here but you're clearing out that confusion you're detaching from 
people, places and things that are not getting you where you need to go. King of Swords, Swords energy with that Seven of Cups. You're cutting out the BS, you're cutting out the confusion here and you're choosing a new pathway for yourself and you're doing it very, very logically here. Justice and this is your justice here. This is going to be fair for everybody involved, including yourself. You are doing what is fair for you, Libra. That is you, the Justice card. Ten of Cups. You've got so many options that can make you happy when you make the right choices here. And I feel like you're in a space where you are making those choices for yourself, Libra. Messages for Libra. Three of Cups in the reverse. Okay, Three of Swords in the reverse. Okay, Four of Wands. Interesting. You could have dealt with an air sign. Water. Fire. Seven in reverse. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The moon card. We've got the six of pentacles. Oh, <laughs> I'm doing that because you, you, uh, similar story right, to what I've got a few times here. Ten of pentacles. Okay. Let me turn this down. Okay. You know, yeah. Ten of pentacles here. You could have a new... You could have an increase in your finances after some sort of stagnancy in your finances specifically here. It could have been that you was waiting for some sort of money here and you're going to get that. So if that's a message for you, please be advised that that is coming through. If you was waiting, if some sort of finances was on hold for you, you are going to get that. With the Ten of Cups there at the bottom of the deck, something's going to come through to you there yeah you might have, you might be a bit worried about this but there's going to be a judgment call made and you're going to get that you could be dealing with a scorpio you could be dealing with an earth sign taurus virgo capricorn energies here also air sign fire here okay so you could this could be a family situation that you are dealing with currently here some kind of established home situation here you could be getting into some sort of new commitment you could have recently got married here or began some sort of family situation with a person here and it's there's a lot of happiness here for somebody or some of you here it could be that you are in a commitment here but we've got this other energy here. I feel like you've taken yourself out of some sort of contract here. The devil is in the reverse. This could have been some sort of attachment that you had. Now, the devil isn't always toxicity. It's It talks about contracts. It talks about habits. It talks about people. It also talks about things that do not align with our greatest good. And with it being in the reverse, I feel like you've removed yourself from a contract. This could be that you've moved yourself from a workplace that was not being um, fair to you here for some of you. And you've moved on and you've, you know, for whatever reason, this, this, workplace that you was at may not have been paying you what you needed to be paid here could be that you was waiting for some sort of raise to happen and you've moved on from a job recently i'm getting that with the four of wands here you've terminated a contract with that devil card in the reverse that's for somebody if this is a love situation i feel like you're in a commitment whoever i'm speaking to here but you've got somebody here who you've released Three of Cups in the reverse and the Three of Swords. There was some sort of interference in a connection that you previously had with somebody. Somebody could have been giving to multiple people. This could have been anything here. Three of Cups, third party situation talks about multiple things here. But there was some sort of interference in the past with a connection that you was in. I feel like you are now, you've moved on to another connection here. But something was hidden from you in the past here. There was something that was happening in the shadows here yeah something was somebody had options here possibly okay let's have a look and clarify let's clarify interesting there was a third party sort of situation i'm getting here or interference this could have been a family member that interfered in your relationship in the past this could have been something where, you know, there were people, somebody had multiple lovers, another person. 
could have been a job this could have been something else that got in the way of a relationship but i'm really getting people it could be friends even with the three of cups in the reverse yeah two of pentacles somebody was juggling you juggling multiple things here four of wands six of yeah queen of so yeah queen of wands you could have had a person that could have been jealous of your union here with that queen of wands six of wands and the four of wands somebody could have been jealous of your union here there could have been some sort of communication to your person in the past here talking on your relationship here in some way shape or form causing an ending this could have been with a fire sign here libra we've got fire we've got capricorn i think i said all the signs before here but they could have caused an ending to a, a union two of cups is in the reverse there was a breakup here page of cups this was very immature very petty energy i'm getting from this causing something not to prosper not something to be unhappy in a commitment that you had previously here we're not going to go too much into the past four of wands five of pentacles you took yourself out of this relationship this is probably a past energy here so i don't know why it's coming up you moved on six of swords five of pentacles and you stop working with somebody stop collaborating with somebody in the past here you've got the three of pentacles in the reverse here you've moved on with the six of swords out of some sort of feeling of lack with the five of pentacles here what's the devil in reverse you've moved yourself forward from a contract here this could have been in the past for a lot of you you could have got a new job but there's been some sort of positive shift forward and with that six of cups you could still reminisce about the past about the good memories that you may have had with this individual here but there's been a shift forward from this contract that you were in from this commitment from something that you was bound to to justice card that's you libra yeah something wasn't balanced for you here with the queen of cups in the reverse here i feel like you could have been in a state of being emotionally codependent on an individual or you could have relied on this person heavily to balance you in some way shape or form with the justice card and the strength card in the reverse but i feel like you're standing in your stance and with that oh, with that rat card that definitely could it just occurred to me that that came out with that rat card it could have been somebody who was in their camp your person's camp or your person's circle who was jealous of the commitment and decided to come between you say something be petty and cause some sort of rift between you in the past but again i'll leave that alone it just just so happened that i looked over here but you've brought some sort of justice and balance to yourself You're, you've been working on your emotional stability here because in the past it could have kept you stuck to an individual here stuck in a way of thinking here with the knight of pentacles and what's behind that yeah king of cups very you could have been emotionally codependent on each other here which was causing some sort of imbalance between the two of you there could have been a lot of deceit and a lot of lies we've got the seven of swords here you've moved on from this here ten of cups yeah the devil you've moved on it could be a capricorn knight of swords you've moved on from the toxicity here into happiness see how we've got the devil card here whatever was keeping you bound you've shifted forward with the wheel of fortune here knight of swords here that's fast movement forward here whatever this was you've fast tracked i feel like the, the divine fast tracked you with that wheel of fortune here you made a decision and you was divinely guided see where see how she, there's the body here the person the being and then we've got the spirit that's on top of her there you've been elevated somehow out of this connection this could have been somebody who you shared some sort of soul tie with past life connection here but you've opened up options for yourself from moving on from this whatever this is clarify the ten of pentacles for me six of cups you could reminisce about this person page of pentacles but you know that it was very petty and you was very emotionally codependent and unstable i just feel like this was not working for you so you closed out some sort of cycle in the past and you've moved on here you could have children with a person now have a family with a person yeah the moon card this could have been something that was very emotive for you you've walked away from the pettiness past energy is still coming up here there was a lot of emotion attached to this here you had a strong emotional tie to somebody here but i feel like it was with that devil card being here i think it was a toxic tie that you had to this individual and them to you also the page of cups in the reverse and the two of cups here just very petty energy i'm getting here a lot of emotions here it could have been a pisces you've walked away from this and it caused an ending here 
Yeah. Ended something. And you've moved into this good energy here. Clarify this Six of Pentacles. Yeah, Ten of Wands. You became tired of giving. I feel like you could have been the one that was giving. One-sided relationship here. So you've protected your energy and you've moved into the Queen of Pentacles type of energy here. You've stopped giving Six of Pentacles. I can't make it up. And you've moved yourself forward. You're protecting your energy, protecting your assets, protecting your emotional stability, more importantly, because I see a lot of emotional instability in your past. And you're, you've become more balanced here. Nine of Cups, Eight of Swords is in the reverse. And you've got your stripes for it too. We've got the Nine of Wands there showing itself at the back of the deck. I love this for you, Libra. Interesting. I don't know why that past person decided to show up here, but... You know, you will know if this is your story, especially if you've moved on to another commitment here. You've got children, you're, you know, in a more balanced emotionally, emotionally more balanced in yourself within a new commitment. And that's that's good for you. Let me get you a closing message here, Libra. We've got lighten your load. You've definitely done that. Blessings. And you're very blessed. You've been blessed because you've You've rid yourself of this. People don't realise that when you rid yourself of certain toxicities in your life, it makes space for new things. It makes space for blessings to come in. And I didn't even remember that at the back of this deck, where we started at was broken heart, attachment and walking away. You cannot make this up. You've detached, you've walked away, healed and you get your new beginning because you've got the victory and we've got daughter spirit here. I love this for you, Libra. Libra, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. It is greatly appreciated. But until next time, I will see you soon. Bye, Libra.